Hi folks, it's Ian Baker, the product specialist with American RV. Today I'm going to talk to you about the 2016 Lance 1172. This is going to be one of Lance's flagship truck campers built to go on a one-ton pickup. It's going to boast two impressive slides. Uh, it'll have a slide-out topper as well as a carefree of Colorado power awning. As with all Lance truck campers, this one is also going to be four season capable and it's going to have all the quality and care that Lance puts into their truck campers. Let's go on in and we'll take a look. Welcome to the inside of the 2016 Lance 1172. This particular unit is going to be in Palm Springs and the 1172 is built to go on a one ton dually pickup. Let's go ahead and start off on our rear slide. So right over here you will notice you're going to have some great storage. This is going to be a pull out pantry here and then you will have additional storage here underneath. Now Lance does utilize the positive latch system which is phenomenal. That way you don't have to worry about anything flying open as you're going down the road. Uh, very, very well built cabinetry in the Lance. As we go around, we can take a look. I'll show you a little bit later. Uh, they use a CNC machine to cut out everything, so it's all going to be very precise, which is a, a big deal. So right here is going to be our back window. That's going to be great, of course, because on truck camper, a lot of times you're going to go to places where you are able to enjoy beautiful views. And so you want that window to be able to see out. And then right underneath that is going to be our incliner sofa. So this is great. It's going to be very versatile. You do have incliners on both sides in case you want to go ahead and kick your feet up and relax. Or right underneath here, you do have additional storage, as you can see. And this will go ahead and fold down into a jacket knife sofa so it's again gonna be very versatile you can sit on it as a couch you can kick up the incliners you can lay it down for a bed uh, just a lot of options that you can do with that and also right here in the center is a spot for a table so you can have an additional table back here which is great if it's just the two of you go ahead and kick your feet up uh, enjoy a drink or two while you watch the TV so right over here again more lighting uh, our window for to let in a lot of extra lighting there you're gonna have your magazine rack right down there as well now over here is going to be our other slide, uh, very large slide. You have your big U dine or not U dinette, but very deep dinette right here. Uh, this is going to be a dream dinette, is what this is. So the dream dinette's nice and easy to use. There's a lever underneath. You just pull that lever, and the table just pushes right down. You can go ahead and put the cushions on here uh, to go ahead and form that into a bed. So that's going to be great sleeping space there. You're also going to have an electrical outlet. You're going to have one in the dinette itself, right over there. You're also going to have electrical outlet on the back side uh, and you'll also have uh, USB ports down there as well so that way you know you can sit on either side if you're working on a laptop or an iPad you can easily plug it in so again nice big window here day night shades and that's gonna let in a lot of light then right up top this is going to be a drop down bunk so you have the latches on either side here you can go ahead and pull those out and drop this down uh, and then you'll have a net that's gonna go up around here the cool thing about that is not only does that prevent people from falling out but if you want to drop that down and use that as storage you can definitely do that uh, the net has zippers in it so you can go ahead and reach in there and access uh, everything you need to so very cool feature LED lights throughout the entire coach in here so you know it's going to use less battery which is going to be a big deal and then you're also going to have a dimmer switch for the lights here so that, that's an, uh, another extra nice feature now when we take a look uh, at the seat cushions this is really neat it's right underneath the seats take a look at this storage here this pulls all the way out huge storage super easy access uh, again one of the extra features that I just love about Lance and it will have locks here so that way again you can go ahead and lock it up so you don't have to worry about those flying open while you're going down the road now right over here is going to be the the majority of our kitchen and galley area uh, we're going to go ahead and start right here on our three burner Atwood cooktop. So this does come with the cover, so that way you can utilize this as additional prep space. But this will, of course, come up, and this then this will fold and sit back. But you're going to have your three burner cooktop right there. Right underneath that is going to be our convection microwave. So this is going to be dual purpose. It will be your microwave. It's also going to be your oven. So the neat thing about that is the convection microwave doesn't put out the heat your standard oven does. So if it's a really hot summer day, you're not going to be heating up the coach by running the oven and it's going to be a lot easier to clean. So that's a, a bonus feature as well. Up above is going to be your fully functional hood with a light and a fan there. Backsplash back here as well as right here, making it nice and easy to clean up. 
And then up top, you're going to have additional storage. Again, the positive latches on there. And this is what I was talking about when it comes to precision. Take a look at right up here. If you notice, the cabinetry goes right up to the ceiling. They don't have any gimp molding up there. There's not gonna be any silicone up there. That's because of the precision cutting that uh, Lance is able to, to utilize with their cabinet work. So that's that's definitely gonna be something that uh, so you can talk about. And you know, when you're talking about Lance and again, the, the construction, this is solid stuff, folks, all right? I mean, it's not like it's gonna fall apart on you. You, you have nothing to worry about. This, this truck camper is going to last you a lifetime. You can take a look in here. Again, extra storage. You're gonna have a shelf built in, which is uh, gonna be wonderful. And uh, once more, that positive latch system there. On the side here is going to be your tank monitoring system, uh, as well as your uh, gen set. Your generator start will be right there. Solid surface countertops here. Uh, you're gonna have your double bowl undermount sink, and then you will have your sink top cover again, just gonna help you utilize that as countertop space, or this is cutting board quality, so you can go ahead and flip that over to use it as a cutting board. Also, you're gonna have a pull-out faucet, make it nice and easy to do dishes. One of the things, I, again, I like about Lance is this is actual hardware. This is not your cheap plastic, uh, you know, run-of-the-mill faucet they put in here. This is an actual residential faucet, so uh, that's gonna be a good feature. Uh, you're gonna have a spice rack there, additional plug-in for anything there. If we can go ahead and open this up, you'll see you're gonna have good storage down below. If you need more countertop space, not a problem. You do have this countertop extension that just pops right up nice and easy. And then if we take a look here, right underneath, you're going to have uh, your plug into the side, and then you'll have your drawers right down here. So you do have a couple of drawers here. They are going to be uh, nice, slow close drawers, uh, full extension ball bearing on there as well. Now, kitchen wouldn't be a kitchen without a fridge freezer. So right over here is our Norcold fridge freezer. You can take a look, plenty of space in there. Uh, you know, the, the crispers on the bottom are clear. I kind of like that feature so you can see what's in there. And then your uh, thermostat and all your controls will be right here on the outside. Right here is going to be your 24 inch TV and this will be mounted on a swing arm. So that way you can go ahead and swing it out whether you're gonna be sitting in your dinette, back on your incliners, or you can swing it out to go ahead and watch TV in bed. Now, there is a multimedia center I'll show you a little bit later that's going to be tucked up here uh, that is a DVD player as well it is all pre-wired so you can just go ahead and pop a DVD in if you want to watch a movie right in here is going to be our bathroom you'll see here is going to be our toilet you have a uh, good leg room there of course we're gonna have our uh, sink top and vanity right up here you get some extra storage as well as a towel bar nice big mirror and like I mentioned huge countertop there with our sink great storage underneath then right over here is going to be our shower with a seat uh, you have plenty of shelving space there as well a hand wand adjustable shower rod and you're gonna have a nice big skylight up top. The bed of our 1172 is going to be a nice large queen bed and it's going to have plenty of storage on both sides. Right over here you'll see you're going to have some adjustable shelving there. Then right up above that is going to be our multimedia center that I mentioned, which is going to be radio, CD player, and the DVD player. Additional storage next to that, nice large window, and you're going to have an additional locker in the corner. You'll have a large shelf up top with a couple of reading lights, and then you're going to have a huge skylight here, which does open up and has a screen, or it can go ahead and shut with a nightshade. And then across over here, you have a larger locker, another window, and a very large mirrored wardrobe with a hanging rod. All right, folks, that's gonna wrap it up. Again, this is a 2016 Lance 1172. It's gonna be a great truck camper. It's no wonder it's their flagship. You're gonna have two slides, the wonderful incliner in the back, nice large open space, just uh, beautiful amenities and quality of construction. Not to mention, this unit can sleep six people. That's pretty impressive for a truck camper. If you do have any questions or comments, please feel free to go ahead and leave those on the video below or you can give me a call here at American RV and I'll be happy to answer them that way as well. Thanks for watching. I'm Ian Baker and I can't wait to see you on the road to freedom.